It was designed by Hertz and Talent, really New York's finest theater architect, and an extraordinary building which had been allowed to decay through disuse. Uh, we restored the facade itself, and the top 17 feet were put back in place, and that's very much in every way we could what Hertz and Talent had in mind originally, a very colorful terracotta facade. And then the public space of the academy really became the front steps. People just naturally spilled out and used the steps as a part of the public space, particularly in summer months. So it, it was necessary to have a canopy. There never was a canopy for some strange reason. It uses glass actually as a structural element. The glass itself is part of the structure. It's not just laid in a metal frame. And that permits the thing to be open and to be reflective and completely transparent. It's marvelous because as you walk up to the building, you can't help but look up as you climb the stairs and you see the full facade. The contrast between the restoration and the original 1906 building and this contemporary statement, which I claim is an ode to Harvey Lichtenstein, I claim it's in honor of him for his contemporary ideas. Those two things coming together are, I suspect, a, as good an example of what I think architecture is about as you can find.